Hey Aquarius, welcome to your reading guys. If you're new, welcome. Please remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell if you want to. Um, to my lovely loyal subscribers, welcome back guys. Let's see what today's message is for you. It is a general reading guys. If it resonates, um, good. If it doesn't, don't force it to fit. I do personal readings and information is in the description box. Actually, I've got a sale on for birth charts at the moment so check out the community section for information on that and let's go let's see what we have for you obstacles oh dear um so you're finding obstacles in your path right now um i feel like they may look bigger than they actually are um just because you know the lighting in this card isn't so great we can't have clarity of what's behind these obstacles you may be even asking why do things keep going wrong for me here like what's going on um, so the road ahead, you're not seeing yet. Maybe a reason for it. We'll wait and see how we go. Uh, passion. Okay. Well, let's see. And travel. Okay. A lot of us are being blocked from traveling at the moment um, because of world events. But I always tell people, they ask me, how am I traveling? And I say, where there's a will, there's a way. Um, so if you have travel plans, there may be some obstacles um, if you're wanting to travel and follow your passions, your desires and dreams, go ahead. Go ahead. Where there's a will, there's a way. You will find it. If there's an obstacle, you will be able to overcome it. You're just not seeing the way ahead just yet. Okay, so let's see here. Okay. Pay... <sighs> princess of pentacles here this is a page of pentacles in the normal deck so the obstacles because you don't have the information this can be somebody's blocked you not talking to you here or you've just planted the seed okay guy know the, guys know the difference that sometimes when we plant the seed it's not the day we eat the fruit right so if you're still not seeing um what you've planted come to fruition remember the seasons okay it's winter right now so um you know sometimes the ground is hard and you know uh things may seem dark but we've just been planted right so we need time to get used to the soil to wait for the sunlight to be watered so the energy will slow down i will say that and i think maybe because we have to go backwards here with venus going retrograde look at you know things that have we've been into into the past let's say um we may want to change that we may want to go back to that but we will be called to slow down and look at that things we're passionate about right now with venus okay so let's see high priestess so you do have all the information you require. I feel like you're just putting this in the 3D terms. Like, no, I can't see. Uh, I don't know the truth. And you do know the truth. I will tell you that you do know the truth. Whether they speak to you or not, you know the truth. Some of you, you might know this person is the one from you. This travel card could indicate that they're at a distance from you. And that's the obstacle right now in seeing each other. And this is why it feels blocked. And uh, you could even be questioning, am I blocked from seeing them for a reason? If you are in communication with this person and you feel like every time we go to meet, we're blocked, um, you could be feeling in your soul that here, um, this person's not right for me. Maybe I'm trying to force it to fit. Um, so the answer is you already know. All the secrets of the universe are in your DNA here. Every chord of this dress, everything you've been through and experienced, everything, you know, that's going on here around you was for a reason. So you know now whether this person is meant for you, even if they've blocked you or they're not meant for you and the divine keeps blocking ways together. Could be for your own protection here. The star, yeah, they could be blocked from you while you heal fully right um this is when we're going through these transformations and we're going on our soul's journey we need to be able to heal okay and sometimes we're our own worst enemy 
and we'll let people in and let them use us while we're healing um, so we never get to the point where we're fully healed so this time if there are obstacles in your way it could be because you're going through this major healing but I feel like you've met somebody who um, you could feel is the one for you with the star here you feel you don't have the answers but you do I promise you, you do, the High Priestess. So if you're feeling, I met my Twin Flame and, you know, they are the one for me, but there's obstacles between us. There usually is on a Twin Flame journey. Um, could be as simple as distance, right? Um, but it could be much bigger obstacles that you can't see your way through just right now. Let's see two of pentacles here so you keep going backwards and forwards is this person my twin flame or are they you know am I just overthinking this um let's see I want to pull an extra one on that ten of swords there will be some resolution to this there will be an answer to this that you will be given um by the divine here so if you're still questioning ask for a pacific sign say hey I want to see a pink bunny rabbit bounce down the street if this is my twin flame Right. So if you see a pink bunny rabbit and, you know, let's just say before this video, you saw an advert for a pink bunny rabbit. There you go. Um, it works like that. So you'll be left without any doubt. The tough part's over. Now I feel like it's about maybe reconvincing yourself to create this new wonderful world that this abundance is coming. Um, so having been through all this ten of swords, these endings, these uh, I mean, look at the obstacles here and this ten of swords everything in your life could have seemed like an obstacle and I'm looking at the color of the sky so if it looks dark and the road ahead looks uncertain what I'm saying to you here is maybe if it's dark you've been planted you're going to grow create become a new unstoppable version of yourself the empress like i say venus is going retrograde so venus representing the uh sorry the empress representing venus here some things some seeds that were planted long ago will be revisited if you feel like you didn't have the answer these cycles will close down meaning you will have an answer where you're left without any doubt here so let's see at uh, the world yeah <laughs> so you're either going to say that person was a karmic relationship without any doubt in my mind now I've let go of that I've healed from that I have the knowledge from that I've grown from that um and I feel wonderful about that you know I send them unconditional love and I'm moving forward um so here that's what we're seeing new cycles new doors opening with the world card because we finally got the answer we finally know we're no longer left in any doubt three of cups some of you it's union some of you this is opening up a portal for union because now you're without any doubt i feel where there was obstacles to travel we now get to meet and we have that passion that's pulling us together and the high priestess here is telling us i knew it i knew it i knew it and the star is that destined meeting with this happy outcome and I mean, thank God, right? After this Ten of Swords, these obstacles that do feel to have plagued you, if not your lifetime, you know, a long time. So we finally get in this good news, this celebrations, this happiness. The thing is what you've been waiting for. Maybe you even felt would never happen. Some of you, this is giving birth to a child or having a child. In this, I feel like probably next year with the world card, this is like maybe somebody having a child here. Queen of Pentacles, yeah, very nurturing energy. This is you finally getting a reward for being the one who, you know, always does the work. Always giving, always nurturing, always loving, always helpful, always there for people. Finally, recognition, finally being rewarded. Look at this abundance. I mean, after having to learn the hard way, I guess, you know, like I said, we all do. Um, but you finally get that recognition because the Queen of Pentacles is like, 
and the CEO of the business or of the family where you're giving so much and everybody else gets the praise for the work you've done and you just stay quiet like, okay, I kind of humble myself and it's not really important to me to have that pat on the back when, you know, it's important to me to make sure everybody's okay. It's important to me to make sure my whole family's doing good. You know, keeping everybody up. Well, now it's your turn to be up. Like I said, this could have felt like a lifetime. A lifetime of being the black sheep of the family, nobody recognising what you've put in um, and what you do for them. Could be children or a mother here, uh, not recognising what you do for them until you start being blessed and start taking care of yourself and putting that healthy energy into yourself. This is Capricorn season. This is Venus in retrograde. And this is what we're seeing. You doing for you. And people being like, what? Like, they're not usually like that. So they finally give you the recognition. I see how much you did for me. Eight of Swords. They'll think it, they won't say it. Huh? <laughs> That's a stubborn person, right? Um, they're happy to think, wow, you did so much for me. Um, but they won't say it. That's their path. That's not yours. They know it. So if this is a family or a child of yours, like finally getting the message that you did so much for them, a friend or a business, um, and they had to learn through losing you. Now they're facing these obstacles alone. They're thinking about you a lot. This is people thinking about you a lot. Um, which is good, right? Because at the end of the day, I feel you've been doing for other people. Queen of Pentacles, you've been doing for other people where they've been thinking about you now. You've actually been physically doing something they can touch, something they can rely on. Eight of, uh, five of Cups here. Um, so they're missing you. If this is somebody returning into your life, I feel like they will inform you that I've been missing you, I've been thinking about you, I want to get back with you here, and then the decision is yours, um, two of pentacles, which you might decide to, I don't want to be with you. I want to close that cycle down forever, and I would like to invite in new opportunities with the world card, so we see the world ending cycles and cycles beginning. If you'd already ended a cycle with somebody you do want back, uh, we see a lot of abundance here. Having worked on yourself and learned to say these healthy no's. So then this person, you feel coming back and the obstacles will be removed. If there's obstacles at the moment, especially to do with travel and things like that, um, don't worry about them. We know why, right, guys? This um, situation with the world... <laughs> the whole world. Uh, so yeah, where there's a will, there's a way. Good luck, guys.